What's going on guys? T2RX6 here back for another quick Transformers video and uh, I actually got a request on my channel to show how to transform Masterpiece Grimlock from his uh, robot mode back to his dinosaur mode. Apparently most channels seem to only show one way. So I figured sure I can show that. Make sure your fists are down here and of course we're just going to rotate his hands on into the little compartments here. Now, I like to on mine flip this one in because this one snags a little bit on mine. Um, the other fist doesn't seem to have that problem, so that does help mine. The next thing we're going to do is come to the uh, legs here and make sure you've got these hip pieces straight so you don't mess anything up, but you want them to be able to kind of fold on down like so. And they're going to fold all the way after, but uh, we don't need to do that now. Uh, as you can see in the process, the uh, let's lift this camera here. This chest piece kind of flopped upwards out of its piece. It just pulls straight up. And that's the next step. And we're going to take this and we're going to rotate this all the way down here. And that should allow us, once we have it in position, to get these little flaps past the, uh, the pieces here. And so we'll just kind of bring that and we'll close that up mostly. And we'll just bring the head on down and around, make sure the head is facing forward. And then once we have that in place, we can snap this whole chest piece together. And most of our work here is now done. We've just got his feet here, which can be, I guess, slightly complicated if you're uh, not really sure what's going on. Alright, sorry for the quick jump cut there. I realized I was doing it and I had it kind of off camera, so I had to kind of reset them. And uh, I'll show you guys again. So anyway, we have them to about here like this. And then the next thing we want to do is come to the feet here. We're going to flip this on out. Uh, grip this, and you can see you can lift it just a little out of that tab. So kind of take that, uh, unfold this, this back tail piece here. Um, and you can see once we lift this out, we can actually rotate this whole thing. Um, it might be easier at this point to get the tail that very tip of the tail out there is a little grip there but take this and bring this around and what you're gonna do is also flip uh, Grimlock's leg so the knee is now facing forward and at the same time you're gonna rotate this whole piece on in and this part really hinges on just having the knee in the right place you want it all the way tucked up in there and you should find that doing so will allow all this stuff to kind of just collapse on uh, Grimlock's back here. And so we'll just do that again for the other side. Flip this piece on down. Flip the tail on around. Flip the little tip piece out. Grab this and flip it. Rotate the leg. Whoops. Sorry. First, rotate the thigh, then we'll rotate the leg here, and just bring the knee so it's fully collapsed up there. And then it's just a matter of once you get here, just getting everything all pegged in together. Peg the, the bottom tail pieces in, kind of adjust the, the top here, make sure everything is all lined up properly and there we go once everything is all pegged in solidly you'll know uh, you can kind of push these little pieces forward a little bit to make them sit a little better on this side here. And there you go. We've got Grimlock back in his dinosaur mode. And everything should work. If we grab his tail, he should do his silly head shaking gimmick if you shake the tail a little bit. Um, yeah, that's all there is to it. It's pretty easy and straightforward. The tail is a lot more simple than it looks. Uh, it's just a matter of kind of flipping things around and 
making sure it all fits properly. So this is TTR X6. I hope this uh, helped if you were trying to figure out how to get your Grimlock back to uh, dinosaur mode.